Hey guys, so I am here with a new video. I know I look a little different than I normally would. Surprise, I'm natural. So um, I will show you guys a picture of how it looks when it's all like flat ironed. I had my sister do that for me maybe like a month or two ago. And um, yeah, just take a look. It's 10.05 and I have work in the morning. So I need to do something to my hair. I'm going to do exactly what I did yesterday. I was gonna record it for you guys yesterday when I had my cute face on, but um, I ended up like running late for this shindig and the shindig was actually for my mama. So we had to go and get a body here. I didn't have time to turn my camera on. And plus I didn't know how it was gonna turn out. But now that I've done it, I can do it on camera for you guys. And um, there are actually plenty of videos of this as well online, but hey, here's mine. Okay, so I'm going to section off my hair. So all that I need to do this is, this is a bottle of water and conditioner. And the conditioner that I'm using is just this little pack here and it's black Jamaican castor oil, moisture and growth leave-in conditioner. So I'm gonna use my conditioner, dampen my hair a little bit. I brought the Eco Style Black Castor Oil and Flax Seed Oil Gel. Um, and then I'm gonna use my edge control. I use the 24 hour edge tamer. This is the only edge control that my hair doesn't laugh at. So we're gonna use that. I'm also gonna use a paddle brush. I would definitely recommend um, a dimming brush, but I don't know where mine is since we've moved. Is it in this box? Hold on, y'all. No, it wasn't in that box. So let's just get right into this. I'm just going to, like I said, start spraying my conditioner on. I'm not going to get my hair like super duper soaking wet, but I do want to make sure that um, it has a good amount of moisture. Now I'm using my brush right now to really make sure that it's worked in there. You don't have to like the way that I am doing this. I'm just showing you the way that I am doing this and what I do for my hair. You can do whatever works for you and or your children or your man or whatever. But this is what works for me. And I really like to focus on the ends of my hair. Make sure I'm giving them enough attention. So this is what my hair looks like, just kind of dampened a little bit. I don't know if y'all can really see that, but. I probably have a lot of damage towards the front of my hair from where I if I do leave any of my hair out, like even for my full wigs, I leave just like this out. So there's probably some heat damage there, which I'm not mad at. You don't see that? I want to make sure that I focus my, um, products on the middle of my hair and making sure that it's gonna get curly. So I'm just going to kind of clip this out of the way. This is a big clamp. And I'm gonna work on the left side of my hair doing the exact same thing. So I'll be back. Okay, so I'm on the last section of my hair. I've already I'm um, persuading my leave-in conditioner and then for the back, I've already detangled, put in the conditioner and the gel. And this is what you got. So now I'm just gonna put my gel in in this one last section. Let's pay some extra attention to these edges. <laughs> okay, is that good? So the next thing that I do is I take um, just a regular headband, just a regular black headband that I have cut, snippity snip snip. 
and I'm going to use this to create my kind of ponytail puff situation. I'm gonna stand up for this part. Our ponytail holder, I'm gonna put it all the way behind my head, all the way down here right behind my ear. So now I have it behind my ear and behind the back of my head, and now it's just chilling. I'm gonna take this, start to tie it, like so, like you would tie your shoe, and then start to pull. And as I pull, I'm going to start to push the band up very slightly in the back. Okay. I'm gonna make sure that the front is pulled as tight as I need it. The first thing I'm gonna do is take my husband's brush and just kind of smooth my ponytail up. So then if I wanna do anything extra with my edges, now is the time. I can live without them one way or the other, but I will say that my husband may or may not wish he was married to Chili and or Ashanti, so I do a little something, okay? Judge me if you must. Really, you can judge your mama. Make sure I'm wrapping my edges tight, but you know, I still gotta sleep, and I like to sleep comfortably. And that is it for me. See you guys in the morning. In the morning. I feel like my puff is perfect, my curls are perfect, so I'm gonna just head on out the door. Well, I'm gonna get ready for work, get dressed, get the kids dressed, and head on out to work. Well, Josh and Jordan are already dressed, actually. So at the end of it all, this is what I got. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I think my hair turned out so cute. Um, yeah. <laughs> so don't forget to leave a comment, like, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And thank you so much for watching.